Let's pause the video here and take a look at the situation. You can see how wet and nasty the insulation is along the base of the wall. Since the house was only four years old, there hasn't been enough time for the moisture to wick through to the inside surface. The area of the insulation that was touching the sheathing on the exterior side of the wall cavity was wet, but the rest of it seemed reasonably dry. Had this not been discovered so early, after all the house is only four years old, the saturation of the material would have continued to worsen to a point the drywall would have turned to mush. Okay, now that we have all the drywall and insulation out of the way, you get an up-close view of the water damage inside the wall. The sheathing has started to turn to mulch, as OSB tends to do when it gets wet, and the damage runs the entire length of the wall, floor to ceiling. All of this happened because the builder omitted a kick-out flashing above this area. It only took four years to rot the front wall of this house out. A $20 flashing has caused ten to fifteen thousand dollars in water damage in just four short years. <laughs> 